sapphire and I could just be beating. You have a mega nothing and you'll like it. Hi, Hi, I'm Mike. I'm John. And I'm Bob. All right. <laughs> and we're going to be playing the Dynasty Warriors. And you're yeah. going to use Liu Bei? I'm going to use Liu Bei because we are never going to use him otherwise. I was going to try and use him eventually, but I was worried about On a that. later stage, you that, That's what I was worried crazy. about. That's why I'm going to use him now like so that we can crazy. say we use them. To quote Lanny, to quote Levy Kravitz. Levy Kravitz. The Lanny guy. Kravitz. Yeah. Hashtag Lanny Kravitz. <laughs> you make my legs shake, I'll make it go quasi. I mean crazy. I don't know why I put a Q there, a W there. Quasi. Yeah. Uh, Stupid yellow turbans. You made me look bad. That show was really funny. It was. There's, uh, a, there's a, what is it, a creepy pasta that uh, Muriel is blind? Or no, death. Oh. Death. That, that's their, uh, that's their, that's their theory behind it. Stupid bubble chog, you made me look bad. Yeah, because, and his swords are pretty cool in this game. Fuck those swords. Ow. Ow. <laughs> Ow. You wanted to use them? I did, and now I regret it. I don't know why. I would have never picked him. I would have just picked Juan Yu or Zhang Fei. Uh, well, it was a valiant effort. And you might be able to turn it around. I would, no. No, you might. But I would never play as him. I'm never gonna, I would never play as him. I would never play as Liu Shan. Oh, I never play as Liu Shan either, but that's because his weapon is a bench. Well, that's an empire. In this one, is is the... In this one, it's here. still the, uh, like, so top view. Okay. Like a copy of you, actually. Will Mike gain any HP back? Well, he's with Stidley. Oh, yeah, that reminds me. That greater evil I was talking about us fighting? There's a dumpling over there. Yeah? Yes, it was a dumpling. I'm glad you I saw it. the, uh... I saw the, uh, little reveal bit for, uh... <clears throat> During Pokemon Sun and Moon, where you got to see Team Skull. I I like Team Skull. They're, they're I, hilarious. They're I like, like ironically like them again because I'm looking at them and they're like, okay, they I got like the bandanas how, and the chains and their name is Team Skull. I like how so help fighting. me if their phrase is fresh to death. I love how Mike's fighting a bunch of named officers and that moves out kind of whipped. It's some people for a little bit. There we go. He might have to rage. I don't know how quickly that refills. Rage against the machines! Oh, la, 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 game of Dossi! That was bugging me finish the siege one day. Yeah, he's yeah. probably a good kid. He was in the area a couple of months ago, like a month or two ago. Oh, yeah? Well, that doesn't do me any good. Because no, he was at uh, too many games. There we go. I wish you would leave me from that ledge, my friend. <laughs> yeah. You mean I, you mean I wish... You mean, you mean Jumper by Third Eye Blind? that stolen Blind? castle you've been living in. No, man. Don't you understand? It's what Josh said. It was, you know... It was Third, Third Eye Blind, Blind by, by Jumper. Jumper. And I was like... We're you're back wrong. to that. <laughs> you're wrong. It's clever, but you're wrong. Third Eye Blind... Which is a very similar name to a uh, blind melon. Now that I think about he's it, he's not here, so we're gonna talk massive shit on him because he doesn't yeah, watch the videos. If, if you haven't, if you haven't uh, figured out that Josh is working like a like a plebe, like a jobber, as John would say. Oh, well, he has a job. He does have a job. He is jobbing at it. Am I wrong in my assumption? <laughs> You're not wrong. He comes onto our stage and tries to one up us. Exactly. You don't one up us, except for everything. Yeah. We just one up each other repeatedly. And since he's not here, we're gonna change. We're gonna rechange Titus back to Titus. Just fuck risk. <laughs> we're starting over fresh. Fresh. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I, I kind of like how we did that. The stack growth is good. The name is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> yes. What happens when we let you decide? 
we get stuck with brand deals that we won't that we don't have but it would be awesome if brisk was just if brisk paid us to say nice things about brisk you know we're such a big youtube <laughs> channel all that's ten of us <laughs> big youtube channel Love you in the guys making. but yeah. all ten of them Oh, yeah, I Shouldn't oh. number it because, again, big YouTube channel in the making. Yep. Yeah. Well, I also don't want to say that because then I don't want Mike's hopes to be back even further. I know, I know. Most of them are friends and family. <laughs> I was a friend and family once. Facebook gets a lot of likes, though. Yeah, I noticed. But yet that doesn't <laughs> translate over to the channel. <laughs> it never translates. <laughs> translated to what? Gonna... Yeah, that comment that we... Still don't know if it was a troll or not. Which one was that? We, we got a comment. So, uh, nice, Facebook guys. I'm not sure if he was trolling. I, I think he was being legitimately nice, so I was legitimately nice back. I honestly think he was trolling, but if he's a, see, that's the problem with texting and stuff and trolling. <laughs> it's it hard. is very hard to catch subtext in text. Exactly. Like I could say that exact same thing and mean it, but like what's going on here, we can think it's just like someone, you know. Oh no, they assemble catapults. Go on you, why don't you deal with the catapults? I'm gonna like go where, with rocks you have to and stuff. Where are you going? You have to You have to save the catapults. Or you have to destroy the catapults. I will handle the reinforcements in the north. So of course I will. Because, you know, I'm, I'm oh okay. Battery. You're going to the north then. Yeah. Because we don't usually do this as Liu Bei. Usually you do it as Zhang Fei because he has nothing to do. The North always, the North remembers. Yeah. This is where Liu Bei gets this province, sort of, kind of, maybe. Isn't this I remember in some of the Empire's games, if you started at a certain timeline, his territory would be up here. No, this so is then where later Liu Bei loses his territory, remember? This is the fight where Guan Yu and him get separated. Lubu's already been dealt yeah, with. Yeah, but he has... Um, this isn't when, uh... Lubu's already been dealt with. This is the aftermath. Yeah, yeah it is, it is. Yeah, this is the aftermath. Because he's got Kwa Shong. Kwa Shong wasn't around until around him dealing with Lubu, remember? Lubu just sucks, uh, because now if G... if, uh... What's my vote? Jai Shu is the one. Yeah, I got one. Right. I'm really excited because I saw a catch a <laughs> Damn it, Bob, this is exactly why we have horrible commentary. Is it? <laughs> I don't know, I think we do pretty great. The Dynasty Warriors games are obviously the best ones for us. I was watching the... I was watching, watching our videos? That's really nice. They actually give them views. Wait, no, I'm the only one that watches their videos? Okay. I was watching uh, some Animu. Yeah, Twitter, and... Yeah. It Bandit's been here. The whole time, you were nice and quiet up until now, so... Yeah. Uh, and I was watching the Pokemon X, Y, and Z. I've not seen any of that. I watched the Poke League, and I am lafurious, like many of the fans are, because Ash deserved uh, the tournament victory. And he lost. Wait, how? Uh, he made it to the finals. And lost to a guy named Elaine. Who had a Mega Charizard. That's... That feels almost rigged to me. And you know what? Here's the part that pisses me the most off about it. He pretty much wiped the guy's team uh, in a good part of it. Oh he, god, Jiggly Azu, you are so screwed. Because he beat, like... He beat at least four or five of his Pokemon before he had to use Mega Charizard. I thought Ash got rid of his Charizard. No, this was the guy Ash was fighting at a Mega Charizard. Oh. And his Mega Charizard was pretty ridiculous. I know that in the one before that, not the episode before that, but in the Pokemon League before that, he had to fight a guy who had a Dark Rye. Ash loses, I think, all but one or two of his Pokemon fighting said Dark Rye. And as soon as he beats that Dark Rye, the guy is like, okay, I see what you did there. I'm gonna set up my Latios. And I'm just like, oh yeah, yeah, because he had uh, he had all the legendaries, didn't he? Uh, we only ever got to see him use those two. 
He only ever needed Darkrai for the rest of the tournament. Ash somehow beat the Darkrai, but then he just sends out another legendary, so it's just, you know. Because yeah, that's basically the story of N. N is supposed to be you know, the super, super dude. But, the um, super, super dude who hangs out on the roller coaster with you. Yeah. No, that's not a roller coaster, it's a Ferris wheel. Very different. Dark wood, yeah. Dark wood, yeah, that's right. We would know 100% for sure. It's after Mike. I know it's after because it talked about while you guys were not paying attention to the story about Lou Boo. Okay. I trust you, I trust you. Also, he doesn't die here, remember? He doesn't die until he deals with Yuan Shu's family, which is still going on. Yeah, I know, because I know the next board is, uh, whatchamacallit? Guan Du. Guan Du. But what I was saying was, I thought it was, whatchamacallit. Ugh. Man. You ever just take a massive shit and then your ass just explodes? No. no I no, no. cannot say I remember. Damn it, Bob, we took an improv class. You're supposed to agree with the shit I give you. You're supposed to validate that you said it. No, you're supposed to go and run with it. Okay, you just want to get yes and for 15 minutes? Yes. <laughs> yes. He wants a yes man. He doesn't want a Bob man. Uh, Who the hell wants a Bob man? Wish that game would come out soon so we could play that. Oh, yeah. What is a Bob man? He doesn't show up about a benevolence. He comes over to my house with a scraggy looking goatee. And he makes my dog whine. And I do not. Hot class hookers. Oh, I'm sorry, we're talking about something else. Oh, Torch trip. Fuck your torches. I will light the way. The Olympics will not happen. I will. That's happening. Oh, no, it is happening. And America was... is winning. Oh. It's all that, too. I was watching, uh. You remember, well, was, friend? They also jump up from up there too. And I was, I was out with the uh, people I was performing that community theater show with last week. Uh, Mike, you suck. We were hanging out at a bar and we saw the. Uh, <coughs> yeah. And we were watching a couple Olympic things on TV. I saw us win in at least one match in table tennis. <coughs> Most of the guys were watching women's beach volleyball though, and some of them got in trouble for it. One because they're the. Uh, their partners saw them watching uh, Women's their, Beach Volleyball. Their partners. And two, be well, because some of them were fiancés, some of them were wives, some of them were just girlfriends. So I just went with partners. Some of them were their sisters, you know, Winsest. Look at Bobby, liquid friend. What is your problem? Well, Ben? I don't know what's up with Ben. Yeah. I guess it's because we skipped him and uh, didn't get him a turn. I would laugh if we weren't recording this entire time. Oh, uh, that would suck. <laughs> no, we just pick up the episode here and be like, yeah, we did some awesome stuff. Take our word for it. <laughs> just two minutes of it. <laughs> um, yeah. <clears throat> Sorry. Oh, no, that's all right. I noticed that, uh, that the, which I'm probably going to check when I have a chance. The, the voice actor for Ash, though, I'm pretty sure it's Naruto's voice actor in Japanese. In Japanese. Oh, well, that would be kind of cool. Because I was just going to say, I know what happened to the voice actor for Naruto in English. She is on a Disney XD show, which I think actually got canceled. Because they, uh... Oh, I mean, what Disney XD show didn't get canceled? Yeah, okay, Disney XD so. is becoming the Fox of Fox. Yeah, they're kind of just running through shows at this point, although, uh... Is Bob's Burger still could... on? It is, but it's, uh, I don't know how to explain it. Disney XD had a good Spider-Man show for a while. I think it was The Amazing Spider-Man? I guess. Is that the one that was in space, or...? Not the one that was in space. I'm, I don't think <coughs> it was in space. Space, space Spider-Man? So they had Drake... It was... They had Drake Bell yeah, playing was to say, Peter Parker. It looked and like that one was going well. Like, it looked like you just, like, wasted that move style, like you just went straight in the opposite direction of the end way. Uh, uh, no, I didn't. Um, no, there, there was. There was, there was like, uh, whatchamacallit. 
I wish you would step It's like Spider-Man 3000. He had a pretty oh, cool one. That, that I remember with the animal people. That one was yeah, cause cool. Yeah, because he went to an alternate dimension, but it was like, it wasn't really an I alternate dimension, it was just the future. The Amazing Spider-Man 2. Yeah. I saw it at work. How was it? Yeah. Well, that's oh, yeah. about the most you can hope for from a lot of comic book movies recently. I mean, I just don't understand, though, why they keep going back to the... Almost... I like the first one because they didn't use the Green Goblin. I was like, oh, they're using a lizard, the lizard, one of his other mates, one of his other... Ones. Why do they keep going back to the, the one, I guess you complained about certain ones? Because literally he has ones that are like the four, po like, they're not called the four horsemen of the apocalypse, Well, they apocalypse, already were talking about the they're terrible six. The insidious six. Yeah, because that was hinted at in that movie, which it's not happening now. Why well, is that? Because the Amazing Spider-Man movie franchise is over. Huh? It got over because uh, Marvel sold. finally got yeah. the rights back. Yeah, and the new Marvel. I will say this, Spidey is the only superhero movie I've seen have numerous redos of the story in very short spans of time. Tobey Maguire, and then after Tobey Maguire's was done, it got rebooted with The Amazing Spider-Man, Amazing Spider-Man, the next two movies. Now the new Spider-Man movie's coming in, I think, next year, and that's a reboot. It's hard to say well, which one was a better Peter Parker slash Spider-Man, because there are so many redos of Spider-Man. Like, there are several when Peter would, Parker is the nervous college student, and then there are some where he's more of a wisecracking guy. I would say that the, what, uh, I think his name is Garfield, the guy who played in The Amazing Spider-Man, I think he did a better job than Tobey Maguire. Oh, for, yeah. Towards the act, at least. Well, Tobey Maguire, I, number three, I want to blame some writers on that one, because I don't think Tobey Maguire went into that and said, hey, I want to do emo Peter really, really weird. No, because I, 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 I don't I hate like, that because uh, Venom doesn't make you go emo. Venom Symbiotes makes you, you angry, angry because it aggro. feeds off the anger. Yes, he wouldn't have been just walking down the street all emo. He would have been freaking pumping iron and raging. Like, you well, know, probably, what happens when Venom interacts with anyone else? I also hate the fact in that movie they made Venom the second... He was supposed to be the main character, but they set him up so haphazardly. It was like... Oh, Eddie Brock's now uh, Venom after 10 seconds. I'm like, that's not Venom. Venom isn't just Spider-Man's black suit black. Yes, it is. Well, it's a mix of... I keep explaining this, but you and Josh don't listen. Venom is the black shit. It's not actually Eddie yes, Brock. Yes, I know. But, yeah, so that black shit the, on him yes, would be... Yes, but Venom, as he is known, because Venom is not... Black Spider-Man, he is not called that. Black Spider-Man is called Black Spider-Man. Venom is an entirely different entity when he is something else. When he when he's on Eddie Brock. Or the Scorpion. Or the Scorpion. What happens is that symbiote is yes, supposed but the, to be... But that symbiote is supposed to be Venom makes you itself. go fucking aggro and huh. become a jacked-out monster, which is Venom. Not always a jacked-out monster, but... Yeah. But... There, was all, there were only subtle monster. hints that Venom Because would... Carnage has never been conceived as a jack. Listen, when you talk Venom and Carnage and, and, and are you Deadpool is are you, getting... Are you defending Spider-Man 3 right now? Cause I'm, I'm not defending Spider-Man 3. I'm just saying the way you're phrasing it, it made it sound like, well, no, the symbiote, the goop is no, not... No, I'm cool. You know what? Because the, the goop itself is the symbiote yes, thing. That I understand is technically that, but I'm talking Venom about when you talk about Venom. Venom is Eddie Brock and him. And when that happens, Venom looks a distinct way. He's usually muscular because it forces oh, yeah. Eddie to work out. When in that, it was just and Eddie got was well, taken well, over. It, it's the the symbiote, I think, just amplifies a certain emotion. Yeah. Because when it's on Spider-Man in that movie, it made him, you know, emo. But yet, but in all the Eddie comics, Brock, it makes him angrier. Yeah. Because if angrier, he working out, jerk to his girlfriend, all that. Because it also makes him aggressive. Yeah. Because that's why Eddie Brock. But is that's why I'm just saying, is. though, in the movie, I was expecting him, you know, to be Venom, a little bulkier, yeah. looks like Venom. Instead, it looked like they just took. They told Booker Gracie to, you know, exactly. do a little bit of, you know. And I don't and... give a flying. Fuck about the Sandman. I'm sorry. I don't care that he was the one that got his, who killed his uncle. Possibly. <laughs> in that movie. They in that made movie, it. they honestly, they made I it that feel way, like. But I'm just. I don't care. You don't put. If you're gonna put a secondary been, villain, it would have been fine if they switched the two. Made the movie about Venom with Sandman constantly interfering. That would be okay because Venom 
gives more to the character. Because one, Spider-Man is all no, about responsibility. Should have. There's, I think, uh, there's there are two more symbiotes that they've added to the yeah. roster. They're adding a new one. They added Anti-Venom, which is Eddie Brock again. It's a what? It, that is a skinny white version, but it's as powerful as Venom apparently. Uh, they're adding a symbiote for Deadpool. Because he needs one. Because people want to see what it would be like. Because wouldn't it just be Carnage even more fucking crazy? Who knows? <laughs> But we can talk about that next time. People just want to see Deadpool do anything right now. I just want... <laughs> I just want Venom to be on the big screen and look like Venom from, like, I remember when I was a kid and watched the 90s Spider-Man. Well, you know who would totally <coughs> suck as Venom? Leo Bay. Oh, I thought you were about to say uh, Elijah Wood. No, oh, that would be a great uh, one. Fine. I'm totally, totally sad and preposterous right now, but... <laughs> And that's going to be it. Uh, Elijah Venom. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Elijah Venom. It's going to happen. <laughs>